Hi guys, this chapter it is pretty long. Uh, the part uh, I'm gonna have to cut this chapter into two parts because of uh, the length of it. So um, yeah, that, that's just gonna have to happen. Just cut scene before you go through the door, so don't worry, nothing's fucked up. If this is cut into two parts, this you you wouldn't notice anyway, so there's no point explaining that. Do you remember that green line? It, it, it happens with the Wii version when I put this in widescreen because it's the only way where, um, if it's like a full screen, then it doesn't, it, most things are cut out of the screen, like take and stuff, so I need to, and my health bar's like really far down into the corner and stuff. There's people, there's a ton of people in here, so be careful. on this this version of the game I'm still gonna be quiet because it makes me nervous still and still it's unfortunate they didn't let you skip it to the bit where you have, like, like a few seconds before you had to dodge that would have been a nice feature so you didn't have to <coughs> listen to this cutscene every time you go through the game but oh well if you skip all the other cutscenes it doesn't really matter but anyway I'll shut up now It's nice to see that they've done the GameCube version, kind of a remake, because they show the clothes of the cutscene. Ah, oh, oh, that's disgusting. I just stepped on something and it was squishy. Oh, he should have aimed for his throat. That would have killed him. I would have fucked him up at least. Oh, phew, I pressed the right buttons. I was going to shake it then. Okay, that was, that was fine. Now this bit you just need to shake you the control until your arm falls off, basically. Well, until Ada gets here, at least. Umbrella? Enough no, slip, enough to no, die, to come die comrade. comrade. That just shows how many times I've completed this game. In every other version of this game, um, the button usually changes that you have to... Yeah, he sounds stupid there, because uh, the bitch in the red dress? She's in a black uniform. Yeah, that kind's ridiculous. Why they couldn't change it? Why they couldn't change you it? Know, I don't know. You belong your life. It's not like you can escape your inevitable death, is it? Looks cool. But um, yeah, basically the buttons change like it goes from A, like this GameCube one, it goes A and then B, and then uh, Maybe PC version like two and three or whatever, three or two, and uh, PS2 A and then circle or the other way around or square and then square or whatever. You just need to break your thumbs on the other ones, but. This one, you just need to break your arms instead of your thumb, so it's quite nice. To be honest, I'd rather not lose my thumb. Well, actually, in 
game talk, I would rather not like tap until my thumb fell off. Is it? It hurts less when you shake your arm because it's the whole of your arm and it takes a while for your arm to get tired. Whereas your thumb can go numb and get tired pretty quickly. So I remember one time I just was pissing around and I really badly died. It was quite funny. I just stood in the middle of one of the lasers accidentally and I just fucking died. It's hilarious. I should have filmed it actually. I, I accidentally ran too far because I had a grenade and stuff. And I'd done the Dipman glitch and I ran too far into the lasers and I went, I got nervous so it kind of fucked me over and I died and it was just like, the lasers just closed in on me. It was funny. If I filmed it, I think you guys would have been in hysterics. Oh yeah, me, I just want to talk about Dazzle for a second. Um, me getting Dazzle, right. I can't tell you exactly when I'm getting Dazzle, but I am definitely, definitely 100% sure I'm getting Dazzle. Just, I don't know when. When I get it, I'll post up a video, um, I'll post up a test video, and put it in the description, I have Dazzle at last, and something like that, so, you'll know when I have Dazzle, because I'll put in, I'll put in, uh, I'll put up a test video, and, uh, stuff like that, so, yeah, um, that's quite exciting. Then I, I don't have to film with the camera and get complaints that, it's mainly, mainly because I'm, better quality but at least that way I don't get any dickheads complaining. I apologise if people do complain. Some people that complain complain for the right reason but people complain because for anyway I'm not even going to say that because it's kind of not the best thing to say. But if I get dazzle it will stop the people commenting on my video saying you've wasted my life because of the, the, the quality is so bad so you've wasted my life. Well, if you know it was going to be like that, then why didn't you, you know, not watch it? But anyway, I'm not going to complain, because there's, you know, I'm, I'm just not going to complain, because there's no point, there's no point complaining, you know. Most of the people that complain to me anyway about the quality and stuff, you're usually blocked instantly, so. I'm not going to complain, it's, it's not that bad anyway, I, I've, so far I've only got three bad comments anyway, and most, most of them, the rest of them are good, so. But anyway, enough of me can slightly complaining and telling you about shit like that it's just enough of it because it's i know i can tell it's boring you guys and you know it's kind of it's nice to even be bothered about to be honest because you know I fi i'm finding out different ways to make the quality better but anyway back to the game instead of me just complaining about random shit then i even know why i'm complaining about that because i haven't <coughs> shit that's close um don't even know why I'm complaining about that, because there isn't any need to anyway. But anyway, no more complaints, just to say that I'm getting Dazzle and the quality is going to be better. Just to tell you guys that and just to notify you. And I- oh shit! And uh, me saying- I know, you're probably just going to say why am I even saying this because I don't know. Me um, saying dickheads isn't insulting. I'm not trying to insult anyone. I just- I just said it. Right, there's a trick. There's a trick to doing this. You can just stand in here without the cutscene being done. And shoot that one. Shoot that one. I think there are the only two there. The one behind you closes. He's right in front of you. Walk backwards if you don't have good weapons. If you if you have a magnum, then yeah, go ahead. If you don't, then walk backwards. <coughs> you can just simply run away from him, but I I like fighting him. I know because he gets revenge if he hits me, so piss off, or if he's in the way like that. Because he traps you like that and it's hard to get past him, he usually gets a few hits on you before you can get past him, so. Right, it's a cheap way of getting this uh, door open. If you have a grenade, which I don't, I'm going to do it the other cheap way. If you have a grenade, throw it over the, over the wall and it blows the sweat thing up on the other side. If you have unlimited weapons then, and you're watch, still watching this, just aim at the side and it blows it up, so. The other good thing is it doesn't activate, I don't think it activates the cutscene where, um, the thing me to, uh, it, it's called it. If, but the thing is, I don't know why it's called it, because it's not exactly a clown. Anyway. Just the quick way of doing it, yeah, it mutates into a massive fucked up mutated pincer of whatever thing. And, uh, you just need to kick this off. Sure, I didn't check the time, I thought I'd, like, gone really badly over.
Oh, I don't want to cut. Wait, I haven't even stopped this, have I? No, I haven't. This so far has been whole one part. A door. So if I cut it, it doesn't really matter. Okay, fair enough. Let's just use this hard because he dickhead. If you have um, just normal rocket launcher, I'm I'm just gonna do the trick that everyone does. Right, if you, ha I'm only gonna use one rocket. Do that. Corrupt him. Knife him a few times. A couple of times. Sometimes it's twice. Sometimes it's once. Instant death. If you don't have an RPG, just run around and he dies still pretty quickly anyway. I'm gonna have to cut this here, guys. I'm sorry because it's so close. Oh no, it's not. I still have to fight crowds, don't I? Anyway, see you.